probably should have done this video before I stopped for the day and moved all the tools and stuff back into the garage. But I'm going to do a quick walkthrough of the framing work that I've done for the haunt. So um, people will walk in, there'll be a doorway here, and they're going to walk into what's called the nursery. It'll be a room here where there'll be a crib or a pram and it'll be made up to look like kind of a scary, scary nursery. Um, so that'll be a nice scare. There'll be a curtain or something in this doorway and they'll walk through this curtain and on the left will be a closet. You can see the door here. Uh, in the closet, there's going to be a Pepper's Ghost Illusion uh, and they'll see what appears to be a ghost and they'll think that's the the, um, the scare. However, there's like a little corner back here where the Pepper's Ghost is going to be an actual person with a, a light on them and they'll step out and scare them. And over to their right, there'll be a wall here which is going to be the living wall will be made the top part will be latex and uh, they will ha I'll have people behind there moving their pushing their hands out I have latex here it's not really working out I've got a bigger piece coming but as you can see well maybe you can't see you know that's kind of the thing um, back here there's going to be another little room and in this room there will be a mirror and maybe a nightstand it'll be made to look up maybe like a a girl's bedroom or a bedroom uh, and there'll be another Pepper's Ghost Illusion. This time it'll be an actual Pepper's Ghost Illusion. There won't be a person back there. I'll have a computer monitor back here projecting onto the glass. Uh, there'll be a another walk through here curtain. They'll walk into this room and this is what I'm calling the crypt. On this side will be the um, the stone coffin where the door not the door, the lid uh, opens kind of automatically, hopefully, uh, with scary music and maybe a fog machine. And then when they think that's the scare, there'll be air jets come out from under the coffin, if that works. Uh, they'll walk through here, they'll see the statue here on their left. Uh, and then there may be some kind of a partition here to partition off the sleeping uh, vampire, which is this coffin here. Uh, the lid will bounce up and down, up and down. Uh, they'll move to their right. Um, there'll be a wall here behind this wall. Uh, will be um, st uh, an area that will not be open to the haunters. The computer, the haunt, the people coming through the haunt. The computer will be here um, running and actors will be behind uh, a curtain doing the, um, the, the living wall. Then here I've got all the tools and stuff stored. They're moving to the spider room. The big spider, you can kind of see him over there. He'll be in his hole. He'll be ready to jump out. Over here, the freezer will be covered with uh, black cloth or something, so it'll, uh, it'll just look like a big block. And the hanging man will be hanging there, jerking around. And um, this will have um, fabric and stuff draped around the top. I want it to feel like you're going into a spider den. So that's it. Uh, not, it's difficult to tell what's going on with just the framing up. Hopefully start putting up the foam board and stuff um, soon.